In this tutorial, what we're going to work with is the actual blend tool. Blend tool works like so. I have two objects here selected. I'm going to uh, align them so they're perfectly aligned there. And with both of them selected, I'm going to select my blend tool and start one. I'm going to click and drag into the other and then click the other one and drag it back into the first. And you'll notice what happens is, is now we get this blend. We have one shape here. It is a blend shape now. That's the object type that we're dealing with. And we get the nice smooth blend in between both of those. So I'm going to undo that there. Uh, next, what I'm going to do is take this particular shape and I'm going to also rotate it. Okay, so go back to my blend tool. I'm going to drag from one into the other and then the other one back. And now you'll notice it actually blends again. So it's not just blending the actual colors, it's actually blending the shapes together and allows you to, to blend some interesting shapes together. And you can blend two at a time. Now there's a couple options available. If you double click on it, you'll notice that uh, under the blending options, when you double click the tool, it's set to smooth color. You can actually uh, check and do, a, uh, for example, specific steps. So in this case, we'll set it to uh, five specific steps and click OK. And what I'll do is um, I'll we'll grab these two other shapes here and I'm going to reduce it down just a little bit just for visual interest. Go to my blend tool. It should be set for five shapes now. Click and drag both of those and you'll notice now that we get the two original shapes in one, two, three, four, five shapes there. Now the, we do have the blend here. What you can do is with the object go in and expand the blend. Okay, and it's going to say the object, the fill, yes, we're going to expand all that. Click OK and then now what you actually have is you've got a group. So under object uh, I'm sorry, under um, object, we want to go and do ungroup there. And now we can actually select and separate out each one of these uh, into some interesting uh, color combinations. Now, why would you want to separate it out? Well, for example, if you wanted to see what uh, muted colors, for example, go uh, with this uh, particular orange and blue, you've got some nice interesting combination. We've got some purples and other things there. So that's a few ways of actually working. Remember to experiment. You do have um, some interesting options under specific distance. You also, this blends uh, aligns to the page. You can also align to a path so you can experiment with that. Hopefully you found this tutorial useful and helpful and uh, thanks again for watching this is 5minutetutorials.com if you like what you see we uh, really would appreciate it if you'd share this website with your co-workers and your friends